Alrighty, hello guys, welcome to Faces back to another Stormworks Search and Destroy video. Today we are actually going to go ahead and uh, continue on with this thing right here. This is our amphibious vehicle and a few of you guys have pointed out that this thing is very slow. Uh, and you would be correct, it is actually extremely slow and that is a bad thing. We're not going to work on that today though, we are actually going to work on adding some equipment to this thing and maybe, actually, some firefighting stuff too. So let's go and get on with it, shall we? Okie dokie, so what I was thinking was that we could actually barrier off this front piece and hopefully make it look quite nice, maybe? So I was thinking we'd actually make it out of this and we'd do something like that, there we go, all the way to there, that's pretty awesome. We'd then attach this guy onto Kia like this and uh, then I think we'll literally just do something with this piece, like that, there we go. That actually looks pretty cool, so we'll leave that just like that, that's awesome. Okie dokie, so now that we've done that, we'll actually continue with this on the top piece as well. We'll actually do, what is it, four? I think it's four, so we'll do that one, and is this a different color? Yep, there we go. So we'll do something like this, one, two, three, four, and then one, two, three, all right, very good. We'll then do this bit, bam, just like that, there we go, there we go, there we go. All right, cool, this is working. Guys, this is working, it's fine. All right, there we go, awesome, and then these two, just like that. Perfect. That's pretty good. Okie dokie. So we can actually go ahead and continue this bit backwards because at the moment uh, that bit being green is just a bit weird. So we'll go ahead and paint that. We'll also paint this little bit as well because I feel like we should. So that's all good. That actually looks awesome uh, and it totally works. That's great. So I was thinking we actually need a cannon. Okay, because I feel like the cannons or the fluid cannons are actually pretty cool. Uh, I feel like we should totally get one and just whack it in right on the front right there. And that'll be our means of putting out fires. So I'll actually just leave that on the front, just like that. That's pretty awesome. Yeah. I'm also going to put this 1x4 in the middle as well, because we should. And that is actually pretty cool. Uh, right, so in order to actually control that then, we want to use something like this, uh, which will allow us to control it. Or, actually, even better idea, possibly, uh, we'll go from one side, and we'll actually drag this in, just like this. Uh, we'll have a piece like that. Good, we'll build this up to there, and we'll honestly just do this on the other side, just like this. We'll get ourselves a piece like this, and we'll have a handle uh, right here. Oh god. Ah! Oh wow, that's still not tall enough. Really? How is that not tall enough? That's crazy. Can I delete these? Yeah, I guess I could. Alright, hold on. Uh, delete this right here, and honestly just build a little piece in there. So, uh, we'll fill this in just like this, that's good. And we'll keep the uh, the floor going the exact same way that it was. There we go. That's pretty awesome. There we go. This is all fine. Don't worry. So that goes to there. Very good. And uh, that goes there like that, I think. Oh, God. Why can't I... Why can't I work this out, guys? What is wrong with me? Okay, so that goes there like that. This thing goes here like this. And that's just how that works, I believe. Possibly, maybe, I don't know. Right, okay, so if we leave that like that, that's good. We can then put this handle right on there, just like so. And that'll allow us to control our thingy-mobobby on the front. I guess that's fine. Okay, so turn swivel is going to be left and right, or A and D. W and S is going to be the pitch. That's it. Good. All right, okay, so we're also going to go ahead and paint this a little bit more, uh, because I feel like we should. We're going to go ahead and paint that like that. That's good. And these pieces are just going to be painted like this. So that one like that, that one like that. And then this one just like this. Okay, fantastic. That's all good. That's really good. Okie dokie. So now it actually has electricity, which is awesome. Uh, we do need to figure out uh, where the thing is. Where is the, the thing on this? Where is it? It's right in the middle, right? Is it? Yeah, it is. Okay, so we delete this. Um, and we put a pump on. A pump. There we go. Okay, and we should be able to put this somewhere like here. That's fine. There we go. So this is out. That's good. We just need this to go down into there, and that's okay. All right, pipes. Let's do it. Let's do it. All right, so we'll do it in white because we should. There we go. Down. All right, we'll then attach this onto there with an angled pipe. We'll actually use these ones. There we go. So that'll go there. That'll go there. And we need a straight pipe to attach those together. Bam. There we go. 
We're then going to actually have this go out the middle of the boat. So bring it in. Take it down. That's it. All right, there we go. All right, awesome. Yeah. All right, do that to there. Go ahead and get ourselves a fluid port, and we should be good. Yep, right. So this will go on there. We'll go ahead and we'll paint it the right color. And honestly, we just need to attach that to there as well. And attach this straight onto... Well, I wonder if space will work. That's kind of interesting. I don't know. Okay, so obviously we can't actually use it as a firefighting vehicle when we're on the land. Uh, but once we're in the water, that should be fine. So let's go take it to the water. And I guess we'll see. We definitely, definitely, definitely need to make this thing faster. Whether we just give it a bigger engine and then call it a day with that, we can have, like, the uh, the clutches all working. That makes sense, actually. Uh, we could do that, but I'm not sure. But anyway, let's go ahead and jump it into the water. There we go. Very good. Engine is still running, which is perfect. We'll go backwards. We'll jump on this, and we'll see if it works. Alright, there we go. Alright, spacebar turns on this, and it does actually work. Awesome. Good. Alright, so is there anything else that we really, really need? Yes, there is. We need some equipment. So, let's go ahead and put some in. Uh, how do we do this? How do we want to do this? Let's get white first. There we go. And then we can start adding pieces. So, fire extinguisher is going to be very useful. That can actually go right here and be fine. There we go. All right, we're going to go ahead and paint that in. That's good. And the fire extinguisher is in. Uh, the hose and stuff, we do need these. Uh, and it would be great if we could add them. So what we will do is we'll have them all here. So there's the hose. Uh, we need a cable, possibly. And also a rope. And there we go. All right, cool. We got all of those added. That's awesome. We'll then paint the outside. And hopefully that'll be okay. There we go. All right, good. We got all of those in. Very nice. All right, what else are we going to add? Some first aid kits. That would be awesome. Let's go ahead and attach those uh, or add those here. We'll add one, two, and three. There we go. That's pretty awesome. And we'll add something else underneath those as well because I feel like we should. So maybe an SMG. <laughs> maybe an SMG because we can. All right, there we go. Put the ammo right below it and that's all good. All right, anything next to this? So I'm feeling a welding torch. And possibly a underwater welding torch. There we go. It's a bit strange, I know, but don't worry about it. It's okay. All right, there we go. All of that's in. Very good. That's awesome. Right, on this side, uh, I don't really know what we should add. Not too sure. We got hand grenades, underwater welding torches. I feel like a defibrillator would be good. So we'll add one of those. Um, anything else that we really, really need? I don't know. I don't know. Uh, probably a flare gun, to be fair. So, a flare gun can go there. The ammo for the flare gun can go underneath. There we go. And that's all awesome. That's it. That's all we need. So, then we'll do this. And that's great. That's great. That works. Bam! Alright, awesome. So, we got all of our gear in the cover. That's great. We've also got these guys back here, which is awesome. Uh, I feel like some added ropes to the outside would be great, too. So... Yeah, I guess we could add some. Right, we'll go from here to here for now. Rope. Rope anchor, please. There we go. We'll have it in this color for now. There we go. So that'll go there. It'll also go there. That's good. We'll attach that together using the rope, the actual rope. That's good. And we'll actually paint this one the right color. Bam. There we go. Oh, that's deleted that. Yeah, that's not good. It's not good. It's not what we want. It's not. Uh, alright, okay, so maybe the rope can go here instead anyway, so we'll do probably three. Ah, yeah, this works, this works. So attach them on just like this, uh, like this, and like this, and we'll attach all of those together, like so, and that's pretty awesome, good, yeah. Alright, yeah, I actually really, really like the way this thing's going. There is still, like, a few things that we do need, obviously. Uh, we need this thing to float a little bit better, because at the minute it just doesn't. Uh, we could add some more of these, which would be fine, I suppose. Yeah, I guess we could just add more of these guys. Uh, which, yeah, it is okay, but still not sure. I feel like we need a bigger fuel tank as well, uh, if we possibly can, but it's kind of difficult. It is kind of difficult getting a bigger fuel tank out of this thing, because uh, it's it's small. It is actually a very small vehicle, but yeah. Uh, right, okay, cool. So, uh, with all that being said... I don't think there's anything else I need to do. Yeah. 
So, yeah, there's our little ropes on the outside. That's awesome. We've added a water cannon, and we've also added a bunch of equipment right in the inside. We also need to add some machine gun ammo, because uh, we have machine guns, but no spare ammo. So, we'll actually add that directly underneath the machine guns. Uh, which, to me, seems like a good idea. So, there we go. Two extra magazines directly underneath, armor piercing, and incendiary. Okie dokie. Uh, incendiary, armor piercing, there we go. So we got kinetic loaded, uh, on both sides, then we've got armor piercing and incendiary. Alright, that should be enough machine gun ammo, uh, for all of those. I don't expect those to be used anyway, so, guess that's okay. Uh, right, okay, well, I think I'm actually gonna go ahead and end this video here for now. If you guys can think of anything else we can add to this thing, let me know in the comments down below. But, uh, I think we'll work on making it faster in the next one. Uh, and doing something like that, so, yeah. Anyway, thank you guys very much for watching. I hope you guys enjoyed the video, and I'll see you in the next one. Goodbye.